ശ്വസിപ്പു മർത്യരാ ഞങ്ങളങ്ങയിൽ for a moment father joseph carodan the director of deepthi ashram will welcome each one of us this is the day that the lord has made let's rejoice and be glad in it o oh lord save us and grant us success jay yeshu good morning to all 22nd february 1968 is inscribed in golden letters in the annals of siramalava church as a historic day when the first missionary society of the siramalava church was founded by his excellency of happy memory mar sebastian wailil on deepthi mount bharnagyanam kerala so today is the foundation day of mst within a short span of 54 years the missionary society has achieved tremendous growth for the sake of the effective missionary apostolate and administration the mst envisages administrative units namely mission region and delegation this morning we are gathered here to thank god the almighty father for all the blessings showered upon our delhi delegation through the intercession of our blessed mother mary the queen of the missions and the patron saint of mst saint thomas the apostle and in a special way this gathering is to mark the elevation of saint mary queen of the mission delegation into a mission region of mst our joy is doubled with your presence prayers and support with the gratitude we remember all the hearts that prayed for us and all the hands that helped us and supported us we also remember our missionaries and friends who are called to eternal life especially reverend father cb nellur the first missionary mst missionary in himachal pradesh who died last october on this auspicious occasion when that atmosphere around us is in the mood of gratitude prayer and jubilation representing the members of mary queen of the mission delegation i welcome our archbishop markuriakos bharnegulangara our bishop mar jos putambitil our mst director general 
വെരി റവറൻ ഫാദർ ആന്റണി പെരുമാനൂർ ദ ജനറൽ കൗൺസിലേഴ്സ് ആൻഡ് ന്യൂലി അപ്പോയിൻറ്റഡ് അവർ ഡയറക്ടർ ജനറൽ വെരി റവറൻ ഫാദർ സന്തോഷ് വാലപ്പുര regional direct and all the provincials fathers and sisters let's ask the lord the way truth and life to bless and strengthen each one of us to be the messengers of his word and also let's pray to the lord to shower his blessings upon this new region of mst and the missionaries laboring here i conclude In the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen ഭക്ത ജനോജ മേ ഈശ്വര മഹിമാ ഈശ്വര മഹിമാച്ച മേശ്വര മഹിമാ ദുഷ്ടാത്മാസേ 
क्योंकि शक्ति महिमारा को निरंतर तेरे संग पिता पुत्र पवित्र आत्मा के महिमा हो वे नित्य निरंतर स्वर्ग पिता हमारे पावन हो वे तेरा नावे तेरा राज सदा पावन 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 और पृथ्वी पूरित है तेरी महिमा से हर गम गाते मानव स्वर्ग सो पावन 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 हम प्रार्थना करें शांति हमारे साथ रहे लॉर्ड अवर गॉड May the adorable name of your most glorious Trinity be always praised and glorified, adored and exalted in heaven and on earth, Lord of all, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, forever. Amen. Amen. मंदिर में उसकी स्तुति करो उसकी महिमा मैया काश में उसकी स्तुति करो प्रभु के मंदिर में उसकी स्तुति करो उसकी महिमा मैया काश में उसकी स्तुति करो तेरे प्रत्येक उपकार तथा अनुग्रह का प्रतिदान हम कदा भी नहीं कर सकते तेरे अनुग्रह और सारी सहायता से संपन्न और दुल्हन की तरह अलंकृत तेरी कलीसिया में हम निरंतर तुझे धन्यवाद देते और तेरा गुणगान भी करते रहे ये सबके प्रभु तो ही सृजनहार सर्वदा हम करते हैं प्रभु जी 
महिमदाते किसु मसीहा सब के प्रभु जी जय गान गाते तन को पुनर्जीवन तू भी करता है आत्मा का था करते प्रभु जी अभी मगाते हैं यीशु मसीहा सब के प्रभु जी जय गान गाते हैं जय गान गाते हैं हम प्रार्थना करें शांति हमारे साथ रहे माय लॉर्ड यू आर ट्रूली द वन हु रेइसेस आवर बॉडीज You are the savior of our souls and the preserver of our lives. We are bound always to thank, adore, and glorify you, the Lord of all, forever. Amen. Harin kalho ushabar ko ne yama. La la ha. संतुष्ट होकर निवास करता है हमारे विनंदी स्वीकार कर तू अपने स्वभाव के अनुसार हमें कर और हम पर कृपा कर के सबके प्रभु पिता पुत्र और पवित्र आत्मा सर्वदा संत पेद्रोस के पहले पत्र से वाचन गुरु और आपका आशीर्वाद इसलिए तो आप बुलाए गए हैं क्योंकि मसीह ने आप लोगों के लिए दुख भोगा और आपको उदाहरण दिया 
जिससे आप उनका अनुसरण करें उन्होंने कोई पाप नहीं किया और उनके मुख से कभी छल कपट की बात नहीं निकली जब उन्हें गाली दी गई तो उन्होंने उत्तर में गाली नहीं दी और जब उन्हें सताया गया तो उन्होंने धमकी नहीं दी उन्होंने अपने को उस पर छोड़ दिया जो न्यायपूर्वक विचार करता है वो अपने शरीर में हमारे पापों को क्रोस के काठ पर ले गए जिससे हम पाप के लिए मृत होकर धार्मिकता के लिए जीने लगे आप उनके घावों द्वारा भले चंगे हो गए हैं आप लोग भेड़ों की तरह भटक गए थे किंतु अब आप अपनी आत्माओं के चरवाहे तथा रक्षक के पास लौट आए हैं हमारे प्रभु ईसा मसीह की जय हल्ले लोया हल्ले लोया हल्ले लोया हर्ष मनाओ हल्ले लोया हल्ले लोया हल्ले लोया हर्ष मनाओ उमड़ रहे हैं मेरे मन में सुंदर भावों की दाराए अब राजा के आदर में मधुर भाव गीत सुनाओ कुशल कवि की लेखन जैसे मेरी जीवा गुण गाए पिता पुत्र पवित्र आत्मा की महिमा नित्य निरंदर गाओ अनाधिकार से अनिंद काल कर सुविधा में तरता जाओ आल्ले लोया हल्ले लोया हल्ले लोया हर्ष मनाओ हल्ले लोया हल्ले लोया हल्ले लोया हर्ष मनाओ क्राउड्स he went up the mountain and after he sat down his disciples came to him then he began to speak and taught them saying blessed are the poor in spirit for theirs is the kingdom of heaven blessed are those who mourn for they will be comforted blessed are the meek for they will inherit the earth Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness for they will be filled Blessed are the merciful for they will receive mercy Blessed are the pure in heart for they will see God Blessed are the peacemakers for they will be called the children of God Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness sake for this is the kingdom of heaven blessed are you when people revile you and persecute you and utter all kinds of evil against you falsely on my account rejoice and be glad for your reward is great in heaven for in the same way they persecuted the prophets who were before you Glory to you Christ our Lord Dear Bishop Jose Director General of the MST Father Anthony Permanor 
regional superior of the newly formed region, Mary, mother of the missions, Father Santosh, Assistant Regional Father Karodan, and other members of the region, the counselors from Deepthi, and the whole MST family, my dear Reverend Sisters, brothers, and the whole assembly gathered here and uh, those who are watching this event online. Adime Dene, E. Divasatende, Asham Sagale, MST, Udevere Pudia region, Mary, Queen of Missions, Dubigar the Mavna, Yavasatende, Asham Sagale, Bhavu Engale, Snake Urum, Nergiana. E. region de Charitram, Indore Namula Parishodi Kimbore, Uru. Real success story Namakavada Kana and Sadi. Tandayriti Pandaranda Mudal, Idvatrendu Varela Patu Varsham. E. Region de Proudanaglomite, Adate Adabaduanite, Vectura Maitin Sadi Janula de Valare Chadidarti Torudi, Yavasatilian, and Esmerikian. Any K. Bishopite appointment to get the day and the Annal Karayam Portaidano. Nartila one the te, Namada Pidakan Mari Namaboy Kandu Akuta the Atu Adiyan Sandar Sicha, Uristalam, Baranagan the Deep Tier. Yana out of Chandra no, Pudi Ruba the Anna, Mission Ruba the Anna, Provasigalana. Other one day we need a new partnership, missionary pastoral partnership. And then again, Yani Rotan Jorsham Porta is on the MST of a proud of the Nangal Villa Grahun Dirinilla. Pashe, Palaile, Anate Pidakan Mare, Siro Malavar Savade, missionary outreach in the end to do be a richer society on MST and the Laria known Dana and out of Chenna Tame Paranade. Another Madame Atikala Machinana, regional light in the day, Adinisham, Amanatu Nelechen, Dandu Bravisham, regional I. Pinedu Anna, Iperte, Anne H. and Galambare. MST missionary vocation highlighted Jay and I Tana, Yansimitru. Angane and the Kirtia than a charitra in the Galaria. And I did the Pandandali Ruva the Dorongama and the MST Garan Odon died. Munam Dorale, Ruva the QND, Mutashiri, Seven Angle, the Nurans Marichon, the Yanya of Sidilla, the Mention Giana, Munam Doral and died in the Dices Twenditana. Adanisham, Kramena, Nambre, Nalum, Nalum, Etai, Nanad Nerte, Sando Shetna, the Glarifedo, Etai, Pine, and Iriti Padina, Lele, Jule, Munandi, the Anna, Namukiduru, delegation now another. E delegation now in our Seretile, E number of Vienna Malarno, Padanon the Verai, Padanon the Veru, Perai, Tanamala delegation to Tanga. And at that time, Reverend Father Joseph Mutuplaikil was the delegate with Father Abraham Chembotigil as the first counselor and Father Sandosh as second counselor and procurator. This is the first time in the world. In Punjab, we have to go to the missionary project. In Punjab, we have to go to the missionary project. Valia or a partner item, MST Gare, Rangatuidiana. Anganiana, we read a proud Nangale, Delhi, Matram, Odingin, and the other day, Idende, Adirti, Varambula, Vite, Panjavileki, Viaviviki. In the number delegation, region Aumbo, we have nineteen members. I was surprised to see that thirty four members opted for this new region. That's why we have to do this. 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 We have to do Ujain Lunde, Sangalile, but a Sinodi Punda, Achinana, and a Sangal Mishnoka Wunde, Ganichi under them. Ibadaku and Dengilum, 
ഈ എവഞ്ചലൈസേഷൻ ഡ്രൈവ് എവഞ്ചലൈസേഷൻ സ്കോപ്പ് നമുക്കുള്ളടുത്ത് അത്രയും ഇവർക്ക് ആർക്കുമില്ല ഇത് അതിശോക്തി ആയിരിക്കില്ല ഈ മൂന്ന് റീജിയണിലും മാമോയിസ് മുഖ്യ പുതിയ സഭയിലേക്ക് ചേർത്തതിനേക്കാൾ കൂടുതൽ നമുക്കിവിടെ നമ്മുടെ റീജിയണിൽ നമ്മുടെ സഭയിലേക്ക് പുതിയ അംഗങ്ങൾ ചേർക്കാനായിട്ട് സാധിച്ചിട്ടുണ്ട് ജോയിസ് സച്ചിനിവിടെ ഇരിപ്പുണ്ട് ഈ ഇടയ്ക്ക് മുപ്പ ഇരുപത്തഞ്ച് പേര് മുപ്പത്തഞ്ച് പേരാണ് ആൾ ഒറ്റയ്ക്ക് മാമോയിസ് നോക്കിയത് റോറോ ഹിമാചൽ പ്രദേശിൽ അടുത്ത കഴിഞ്ഞ പ്രാവശ്യം കൊച്ചുതാവും സന്തോഷത്തിനൊക്കെ പോയപ്പോൾ ദേ ബാപ്റ്റൈസ് അനദർ തേർട്ടി ഫൈവ് ചിലപ്പോഴൊക്കെ പറയും നമ്മൾ പുറത്ത് പറയാൻ പാടില്ല മിണ്ടരുത് ആൾക്ക് ഒരു ഒരു പ്രശ്നവുമില്ല തമ്പുരാൻ്റെ കാലത്ത് വരെ ഈ സിറ്റുവേഷൻ ഉണ്ടായിരുന്നു അതുകൊണ്ടാണ് തമ്പുരാൻ പറഞ്ഞത് നിങ്ങൾ എവിടെയും ചെല്ലുമ്പോൾ പ്രശ്നമുണ്ടെങ്കിൽ കാലിലെ പൊടി തട്ടിയിട്ട് അവിടെ നിന്ന് പോരുക അടുത്ത സ്ഥലത്തേക്ക് പോകാൻ പറഞ്ഞത് ഇതിപ്പോൾ നമ്മൾ മാത്രം അഭിമുഖീകരിക്കുന്ന അല്ലെങ്കിൽ ഇപ്പോഴത്തെ സർക്കാരിൻ്റെ പ്രത്യേക സാഹചര്യം കൊണ്ട് അഭിമുഖീകരിക്കുന്ന പ്രത്യേക സാഹചര്യമല്ല അതുകൊണ്ട് നമ്മൾ പേടിച്ച് മാറേണ്ട ആവശ്യമില്ല നമ്മുടെ കോൺസ്റ്റിറ്റ്യൂഷൻ ആസ് ലോങ് ആസ് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് സേഫ് ആൻഡ് സെക്കുലർ നമുക്ക് അതിനുള്ള സ്വാതന്ത്ര്യമുണ്ട് അപ്പോൾ ഈ റീജൻ്റെ പേരിൽ വളരെ പ്രേക്ഷിത പ്രവർത്തന രംഗത്ത് സജീവമായിട്ട് മുമ്പോട്ട് പോവുകയാണെന്നാണ് ഞാൻ സൂചിപ്പിക്കുക ഇത് കൃത്യമായിട്ട് നമ്മുടെ വിഷൻ കോൺസെപ്റ്റ് ഓഫ് എം എസ് ടിയുടെ ലൈൻ പിടിച്ചിട്ട് തന്നെയാണ് ഞാൻ കഴിഞ്ഞ പ്രാവശ്യം പരിശോധിക്കായിരുന്നു എൻ്റെ പറഞ്ഞിട്ടുള്ളത് ഇതാണ് എം എസ് ടി സെൻ വിഷൻ ലിവിങ് ദി വാല്യൂസ് ഓഫ് ജീസസ് ആൻഡ് ഷെയറിംഗ് ദ സെയിം വിത്ത് പീപ്പിൾ ഓഫ് ഓൾ ഫെയ്ത്ത് ആൻഡ് കൾച്ചേഴ്സ് എനി വെയർ ഇൻ ദ വേൾഡ് ഇൻ ലയൻ വിത്ത് മിഷൻ ആദ് ജന്തസ് ആൻഡ് ഫോർ എസ്റ്റാബ്ലിഷിംഗ് എ മോർ ഹാർമോണിയസ് സൊസൈറ്റി ഈ ഹാർമോണിയസ് എന്നുള്ളത് ഞാൻ അണ്ടർലൈൻ ചെയ്യാണ് കാരണം നമ്മൾ പിന്നീട് കാണും ഇത് ഇന്നത്തെ നമ്മുടെ പ്രവർത്തനങ്ങൾക്ക് പ്രേക്ഷിത പ്രവർത്തനങ്ങൾക്ക് വളരെ ആവശ്യമായിട്ടുള്ള ഒരു സ്വഭാവ വിശേഷമാണ് ഇവിടെ ഒത്തിരി പ്രവേശിത പ്രവർത്തനം നടത്തുന്ന സിസ്റ്റേഴ്സ് ഇവിടെ ഇരിപ്പുണ്ട് ഓപ്പണിങ് അപ്പ് റിലേഷൻഷിപ്പ് വിത്ത് അതേഴ്സ് ഇൻ എ വിത്ത് എ ഹാർമോണിയസ് റിലേഷൻഷിപ്പ് ടു ഫോം എ ഹാർമോണിയസ് സൊസൈറ്റി ഈ ഇടയ്ക്ക് മാർപ്പാപ്പ ഈ വാക്ക് ഉപയോഗിച്ചു അതുകൊണ്ടാണ് ഞാനത് അണ്ടർലൈൻ ചെയ്യാമെന്ന് പറഞ്ഞത് ഈ വിഷൻ കോൺസെപ്റ്റിൻ്റെ ലാസ്റ്റ് മൂന്ന് കൺ മൂന്ന് ആശയങ്ങൾ നമ്മൾ നോക്കിയാൽ അതിനനുസരിച്ച് തന്നെയാണ് ഫരിതവാദി രൂപതയിൽ കൃത്യമായിട്ട് എം എസ് ടിയും ആയിട്ടുള്ള മിഷണറി പാർട്ട്ണർഷിപ്പ് നമ്മൾ നടത്തുക വൺ റീച്ചിങ് ഔട്ട് ടു പീപ്പിൾ ഓഫ് ഓൾ ഫെയ്ത്ത്സ് ആൻഡ് കമ്മ്യൂണിറ്റീസ് ഇൻ എ സ്പിരിറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഫ്രണ്ട്ലി റിലേഷൻസ് ആൻഡ് കൊളാബറേഷൻസ് ടു റെൻഡറിങ് പാസ്റ്ററൽ കെയർ ടു മൈഗ്രൻസ് ഫ്രം ദ സീറോ മലബാർ ചർച്ച് ഇൻ ഇന്ത്യ ആൻഡ് ഔട്ട് സൈഡ് ത്രീ ഇൻവോൾവിങ് ഇൻ വേരിയസ് ഹ്യൂമാനിറ്റേറിയൻ സർവീസസ് ടു മേക്ക് ഹ്യൂമൻ ലൈഫ്സ് മോർ ഡിഗ്നിഫൈഡ് ആൻഡ് മീനിങ് ഫുൾ ചിലപ്പോൾ നമ്മൾ ചിന്തിക്കാറുണ്ട് ഇത് എം എസ് ടിയുടെ അത് രൂപതയുടെ അങ്ങനെയില്ല കോൺസ്റ്റിറ്റ്യൂഷനിൽ പറഞ്ഞിരിക്കുന്നതാണ് നമ്മൾ മറ്റ് കാര്യങ്ങൾ ചെയ്യുന്നതോടൊപ്പം തന്നെ വിത്ത് കൊളാബറേഷൻ ആൻഡ് പാസ്റ്റൽ കെയർ ഓഫ് ദ മൈഗ്രൻറ്റ് നമ്മളൊരു മൈഗ്രൻറ്റ് ഡയസിസ് ആണ് അതാണ് ഇവിടെ ചെമ്പോട്ടി അച്ഛനും ബാബു അച്ഛനും ഒക്കെ ഡയസിസിന് വേണ്ടിയിട്ട് ഇപ്പോൾ ഡായി അച്ഛനും വന്നിട്ടുണ്ട് ഡയസിസിലെ എൻ്റെ കീഴിൽ നേരിട്ട് വർക്ക് ചെയ്യാം അതോടൊപ്പം തന്നെ നമുക്ക് മിഷണറി പ്രവർത്തനം നടത്തുന്ന ഒത്തിരിയേറെ സെൻറ്റേഴ്സ് നമുക്കുണ്ട് ദ ലാസ്റ്റ് പോയിൻ്റ് ഞാൻ പറഞ്ഞത് വേരിയസ് ഹ്യൂമാനിറ്റേറിയൻ സർവീസസ് എനിക്ക് തോന്നണ നമ്മുടെ ഈ റീജിയൺ ചെയ്യുന്ന അത്രയും ഹ്യൂമാനിറ്റേറിയൻ സർവീസസ് വേറെ ഒരു റീജിയണിലുണ്ടോ എന്നുള്ള ഡയറക്ടർമാരെ കൂടി ഇരിപ്പുണ്ട് എനിക്ക് സംശയമുണ്ട് ഈ സന്തോഷച്ചൻ ഇവിടുത്തെ എയ്ഡ്സ് ഈ ഈ സ്ഥാപനത്തിൽ തന്നെ രണ്ട് ഹൗസുകൾ ഫോർ എയ്ഡ്സ് അഫക്റ്റഡ് ഇൻഫെക്റ്റഡ് ബോയ്സ് ആൻഡ് ഗേൾസ് അതുപോലെ തന്നെ നമ്മുടെ റാക്ക് പിക്കേഴ്സിനുള്ള കാര്യങ്ങൾ നമ്മുടെ കുരീനച്ചിന് ഇവിടെ ഇരിപ്പുണ്ട് കൊച്ചട്ടുണ്ടിൽ അച്ഛൻ്റെ കൂട്ടത്തിൽ ഞാൻ ഒരിക്കൽ അവിടെ പോയി ഈ ഇത് സെൻറ്റേഴ്സൊക്കെ ഞാൻ വിസിറ്റ് ചെയ്താണ് വലിയൊരു ശുശ്രൂഷയാണ് നമ്മൾ ഈ പൂറസ്റ്റ് ഓഫ് ദ പൂവർ ദോസ് ഉ ലിവ് ഇൻ ദ പെരിഫറീസ് മാർപ്പാപ്പ എപ്പോഴും പറയുന്ന സംഗതിയാണ് ദോസ് ലിവ് ഇൻ ദ പെരിഫറീസിന് നൽകുക ഇതുപോലെ തന്നെയാണ് പഞ്ചാബിലും അതുപോലെ തന്നെ ഹിമാചൽ പ്രദേശത്തിലുമുള്ള നമ്മുടെ ശുശ്രൂഷകളെയും ഈ സമൂഹത്തിലെ പാർശ്വവൽക്കരിക്കപ്പെട്
അടുത്ത കാലത്തെ ഇന്ത്യയ്ക്ക് പുറത്തു കേരളത്തിന് പുറത്തുള്ള പ്രവർത്തനങ്ങൾ നമ്മൾ നിഷ്പക്ഷമായിട്ട് വിലയിരുത്തുമ്പോൾ മനസ്സിലാക്കാനായിട്ട് സാധിക്കും ഈ കഴിഞ്ഞ ആഴ്ചയിലെ മാർപ്പാപ്പ ഓറിയൻറ്റൽ കോൺഗ്രിഗേഷൻ്റെ പ്ലീനറി മീറ്റിങ്ങിൽ നമ്മുടെ മേജർ ആർച്ച് ബിഷപ്പും അതിൽ സംബന്ധിച്ചിരുന്നു പ്ലീനറി മീറ്റിങ്ങിൽ പറഞ്ഞൊരു കാര്യം നിങ്ങൾ ശ്രദ്ധപ്പെടുത്താനായിട്ട് ഞാൻ ആഗ്രഹിക്കുകയാണ് പിതാവ് പറഞ്ഞതാണ് ഐ കോട്ട് ഫോർ ദിസ് റീസൺ യുവർ സെഷൻസ് ഹാവ് ഡെൽറ്റ് വിത്ത് എവഞ്ചലൈസേഷൻ വിച്ച് കോൺസ്റ്റിറ്റ്യൂട്ട്സ് ദി ഐഡൻറ്റിറ്റി ഓഫ് ദ ചേർച്ച് എവരി വെയർ ആൻഡ് ദ വൊക്കേഷൻ ഓഫ് ഈച്ച് ബാപ്റ്റൈസ്ഡ് പേഴ്സൺ ഫോർ ദ സേക്ക് ഓഫ് മിഷൻ വി മസ്റ്റ് പേ ക്ലോസ് ഹീഡ് ടു ദ റിച്ച്നെസ് ഓഫ് ഡിഫറെൻറ്റ് ട്രഡീഷൻസ് ഇതാണ് നമ്മൾ ചെയ്യേണ്ടത് നമ്മൾ അത്യാവശ്യം വേണ്ട കാര്യങ്ങളൊക്കെ ചെയ്ത് സമാധാനിച്ച് പറ്റുമെങ്കിൽ അത് കേരളത്തിൻ്റെ നാല് അതിർത്തി വരമ്പുകൾക്കുള്ളിൽ തന്നെ നിന്ന് കഴിഞ്ഞിട്ട് നമ്മൾ തൃപ്തിപ്പെട്ടിട്ട് കാര്യമില്ല വി ഷുഡ് ഗെറ്റ് ഔട്ട് ഓഫ് കേരള വി ഷുഡ് ഗോ ടു ദ സ്ട്രീറ്റ്സ് ഓഫ് ദ വേൾഡ് ദ സൊസൈറ്റി ലോകത്തിൻ്റെ എല്ലാ സ്ഥലത്തും പോയിട്ട് ഈ സുവിശേഷവൽക്കരണം നടത്താനായിട്ട് നമുക്ക് സാധിക്കണം അതാണ് കഴിഞ്ഞ ആഴ്ച പോലും മാർപ്പാപ്പ നമ്മെ ഉദ്ബോധിപ്പിച്ചത് അതിൻ്റെ അവസരത്തിൽ തന്നെ പിതാവ് ഇങ്ങനെ പറഞ്ഞത് ഐ തിങ്ക് ഫോർ എക്സാമ്പിൾ the process of adult catechumenate capable of accompanying the baptized of all ages to a mature and joyful membership in the christian community precious in this are the different forms of ministry in the church as well as the harmonious relationship nerthe nammada concept concept lulla adhe expression aanu the harmonious relationships with the men and women religious who operate in accordance with their proper charism also in your own context idana mar papa adutha kalathe nammodu parnjathu nammude roopada ee varsham 10th varshathilana ee 10th varshathile siro emalavar faridabad roopadayade etthavum prakadamayittulla oru swabhav vishesham allengil oru trait or characteristics endha nu vichale that's our missionary outreach നമ്മളിവിടെ ഈ ഡൽഹിയുടെ എൻ സി ആറിൻ്റെ പരിധിക്കുള്ളിൽ മാത്രം നിന്നിരുന്ന ഒരു ഡയസിസ് അല്ലെങ്കിൽ സുറമലബാർ സഭയുടെ ഒരു സംവിധാനം ഇന്ന് ഈ ആറ് സംസ്ഥാനങ്ങളിലായിട്ട് സജീവമായിട്ട് സന്നിഹിതമാണ് പ്രത്യേകിച്ചും പഞ്ചാബിൽ നമുക്കിപ്പോൾ മുപ്പത്തി അഞ്ച് സ്റ്റേഷൻസ് ഉണ്ട് അതിൽ തന്നെ കുറേ സ്റ്റേഷൻസ് ഇവിടെ സന്തോഷത്തിൻ്റെ കീഴിലാണ് എം എസ് ടി സഭയുടെ നേതൃത്വത്തിലാണ് ഈ മിഷണറി ഔട്ട്റീച്ച് വേണമെന്നാണ് സഭയുടെ അടിസ്ഥാനമായിട്ടുള്ള ദൗത്യമെന്നാണ് മാർപ്പാപ്പ നമ്മെ ഉത്ബോധിപ്പിച്ചിട്ടുള്ളത് അങ്ങനെ നല്ല ഈ സഭയിലെ മാർപ്പാപ്പയെയും സഭാ സംവിധാനങ്ങളും ആഗ്രഹിക്കുന്ന പോലെ സുവിശേഷവൽക്കരണത്തിലൂടെ നമുക്ക് അന്യമായിട്ടുള്ള അപരിചിതമായിട്ടുള്ള സമൂഹങ്ങളിലേക്ക് കടന്നു ചെന്ന് പ്രത്യേകിച്ചും സാമൂഹ്യ പ്രവർത്തനങ്ങളിലൂടെ കടന്നു ചെന്ന് അവിടെ അവിടെയെല്ലാം ഈശോയുടെ കരുണാർദ്ധനമായ സ്നേഹത്തിൻ്റെ സാക്ഷികളാകുവാനായിട്ട് ഈ പുതിയ റീജിയണ് സാധിക്കട്ടെ അത് നമുക്ക് ഒത്തൊരുമിച്ച് ആ ലക്ഷ്യത്തിന് വേണ്ടി പ്രവർത്തിക്കാം നിങ്ങൾക്കൊരിക്കൽ കൂടി എല്ലാവിധ ഭാവങ്ങൾ നേരുകയും ഈ നല്ല ബന്ധത്തിന് ഗുഡ് കൊളാബറേഷന് ആനണി അച്ഛൻ തുടങ്ങി കൗൺസിലേഴ്സ് തുടങ്ങി എം എസ് ടി ഫാമിലിയോട് മുഴുവൻ നമ്മുടെ രൂപതയ്ക്കുള്ള നന്ദിയും കടപ്പാടും അറിയിച്ചുകൊണ്ടും എല്ലാവിധ ആശംസകളും നേരുന്നുകൊണ്ടും നിർത്തുന്നു പിതാവിൻ്റെയും പുത്രൻ്റെയും പരിശുദ്ധാത്മാവിൻ്റെ നാമത്തിൽ ആമേൻ हम पश्चाताप और श्रद्धा भक्ति से अपने प्रभु के दिव्य चरणों में विनय करें हे प्रभु दया कर हे प्रभु दया कर हे दयालु पिता हे सांतुन दाता हम तेरे शरण आते हैं हे प्रभु दया कर हे तारण हार हे पालन हार हम तेरे शरण आते हैं हे प्रभु दया कर सारे विश्व की और सब कलेसियाओं की शांति के लिए एकता और स्थिरता के लिए हम तेरे शरण आते हैं हे प्रभु दया कर अनुकूल मौसम के लिए अच्छी फसल के लिए सारी दुनिया की समृद्धि के लिए हम तेरे शरण आते हैं हे प्रभु ईसा मसीह की समस्त कलीसिया के परमाध्यक्ष रोम के शंभुज माँ फ्रांसिस्कोस के लिए हमारे कलीसिया के पिता और मुख्य मेजर आर्च बिशप मार्गी वर्गीस के लिए हमारे महाधर्माध्यक्ष मार कुरियाकोस के लिए हमारे सहायक धर्माध्यक्ष मार जोस के लिए उनके सहसेवकों के लिए हम तेरे शरण आते हैं हे प्रभु दया कर 
हे हमारे प्रभु ईसा मसीह अपने कृपा से हमारा उद्धार कर अपनी शांति हमें प्रदान कर और हम पर दया कर हे प्रभु दया कर हे दयालु और सर्वशक्तिमान ईश्वर हम इस पवित्र बलिदान में एम एस धर्म समाज को तेरे श्री चरणों में समर्पित करते हैं इस धर्म समाज के प्रत्येक सदस्य पर तेरा बहुमूल्य आशीर्वाद प्रदान कर हे प्रभु इस धर्म समाज को सभी विशिष्ट वरदानों से भर दे इसके द्वारा किए जाने वाले प्रत्येक प्रयास को पवित्र आत्मा की सहायता प्रदान कर ताकि इस इलाके में सुसमाचार का मार्ग प्रशस्त करने और तेरी महिमा का बखान करने और सबों की भलाई के लिए कार्य करने में प्रत्येक मिशनरी सफल हो जाए हे प्रभु हमारी विनती सुन हे प्रभु हमारी विनती सुन हे परमपिता हम विशेष रूप से फरीदाबाद धर्म प्रांत के लिए प्रार्थना करते हैं जिसको सक्रिय सहयोग देकर हम अपने विभिन्न कार्य करते हैं हे प्रभु हमारे महाधर्माध्यक्ष मार्कुरियाकोस और सहायक धर्माध्यक्ष मार्क जोस के लिए दुआ करते हैं जो धर्म प्रांत का मार्गदर्शन करने में अहम भूमिका निभाते हैं तेरे द्वारा सौंपे गए झुंड के देखरेख और पालन पोषण भली भांति करने में इन्हें कार्यकुशल बना दे हे प्रभु इस धर्म प्रांत पर अपना विशेष कृपा धन प्रचुर मात्रा में बरसा दे ताकि इसके सभी कार्यकलापों द्वारा सुसमाचार का प्रचार प्रसार व पवित्र कलेसिया की अभिवृद्धि हो वे हे प्रभु हमारे विनती सुन हे प्रभु हमारी विनती सुन हे सर्वगुण संपन्न ईश्वर हम एम एस टी के नवनिर्मित मेरी क्यून ऑफ मिशन दिल्ली क्षेत्र के लिए विनय करते हैं जिसने तेरे भरपूर अनुग्रह की बदौलत ये आकर्षक ऊंचाई प्राप्त की है हे प्रभु तूने चमत्कारी ढंग से इस अनुग्रह पूर्ण क्षण को स्थापित करने का मार्ग प्रशस्त किया है हम इस क्षेत्र के उन सभी सदस्यों के लिए निवेदन करते हैं जो पहले से यही यहाँ मौजूद हैं और जिन्होंने यहाँ सेवा निभाने का विकल्प चुन लिया है विशेष रूप से नए क्षेत्रीय निर्देशक फादर संतोष और उनके टीम के अन्य सदस्यों को अपने दिव्य ज्ञान में भाग लेकर उनके प्रयत्नों में प्रयोग करने का वर दे हे प्रभु हमारे विनती सुन हे प्रभु हमारे विनती सुन हम सब अपने आप को और हर एक अपने आप को पिता पुत्र और पवित्र आत्मा के दिव्य चरणों में समर्पित करे हे हमारे ईश्वर हम समर्पित करते हैं लॉर्ड ऑल माइटी गॉड वी हम्बली इम्प्लोर यू फिलस विद योर मेरसीफुल ग्रेस for forth your gifts through our hands may your blessings and grace obtain forgiveness of debts and remission of sins for the flock you have chosen in your infinite mercy the father the son and the holy spirit lord of all forever amen जीवन वरदान तेरा मेरा सर्व सदान तेरा मेरा ये जीवन वरदान तेरा मेरा सर्व सदान तेरा गेहूँ की रोटी दाक रस का प्यारा इनके संग लाया मैं भगवन तेरा दिया हुआ ये सारा धन स्वीकार ले प्रभु इनको कर दे इन सब को आज पावन रोटी वाक रस की भाती दिव्य संस 
पुरस्कार बना दे मुझे भी पुत्र पवित्र आत्मा की स्तुति हम गाए नित्य निरंतर ईश माता मरियम धर्म यो सफ का स्मरण हो वे बली वेदी पर काल से आनंद काल महिमा हो रे नित्य निरंद पुत्र प्रेरित उसके बंदो विनत करिए शांति विराजे सब जन कहिए हामे नामे इस पावन वेदी पर मनाते संत तो मस की याद हम करते विजय भक्तो शहीदों के स शक्तिमान प्रभु सातवारे राजा विराज सातवारे प्रभु परमेश्वर सातवारे या कुश समार हमारा छोटे बड़े सभी मृतक प्यारे सोते रहे हैं इस आशा में प्रभु वर अपने पुनरुत्थान द्वारा सबको पुनर्जीवित कर देगा प्रभु के सामने खोलो मन को उपवास प्रार्थना पश्चाता से यीशु मसी और परम पिता को पवित्र आत्मा को प्रीति कर ले वी बिलीव इन वन गॉड द फादर ऑलमाइटी क्रिएटर ऑफ ऑल थिंग्स विजिबल एंड इनविजिबल And, and in one Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, Christ the, the only begotten Son of God, the firstborn of all creatures, born of the Father before all ages, and not made through God from through God, consubstantial with His Father, through Him the worlds were formed, and all things were created, for the sake of His men and for our salvation, He came down from heaven and became incarnate by the Holy Spirit. and became man and was conceived and born of the virgin mary he suffered and was crucified in the days of pontius pilate died and was buried and on the third day rose again as it is written he ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of his father he will come again to judge the dead and the living we believe in one holy spirit the spirit of truth who proceeds from the father the life giving spirit We believe in one holy Catholic and apostolic church. We confess one baptism for the remission of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. May God, the Lord of all, strengthen you to sing His praises. Let us pray. Peace be with us. Let us pray for the memory of our fathers, the patriarchs and the bishops, and for all the priests, deacons, young men and virgins, our parents, brothers and sisters, sons and daughters. Let us remember all the rulers who love Christ and are faithful to Him, and all who have departed from this world in true faith. Through the grace of Christ, may this sacrifice obtain for us help, salvation, and life everlasting in the kingdom of heaven.
us, O Lord. Pray for us, brothers and sisters, that this Kurbana may be fulfilled through my, our hands. May God, the Lord of all, strengthen you to fulfill his will. May he accept this Kurbana and be pleased with the sacrifice you offer for yourself, for, for us, us, and for the whole world. Lord, our God, we thank you for the abundant graces you have showered on us. For though we are sinful and weak, through your infinite mercy, you have made us worthy to be ministers of the sacred mysteries of the body and blood of your anointed one. We implore you to strengthen us, to celebrate with deep love and true faith these gifts that you have given us. We offer you praise and honor, worship and thanksgiving, now, always, and forever. Amen. Peace be with you. With, with you and, and with your spirit. spirit. My brothers and sisters, give peace to one another in the love of Christ. Let us thank the Lord and entreat him with pure and contrite hearts. Let us stand with the due reverence and be attentive to the awe-inspiring mysteries being celebrated here. The priest is imploring that peace may flourish through his intercession. Bowing our heads, let, let us lift up our thoughts to heaven and pray fervently and devotedly in your hearts. Peace be with us. सिंह का कृपा वरदा परम पिता का प्रेम महा दिव्यात्मा की सहचरिता साथ हमारे रहे सदा ओर लगाए अपने हृदय विचारों को प्राणी सहादा को के स्वर प्रभु सदके प्रभुवर ईश्वर तो चढ़ा रहे Lord of all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, the adorable name of your most blessed Trinity is worth of honor from every mouth, thanksgiving from every tongue, and praise from every creature. For in your great kindness, you created the world and everything in it, and showed humanity your immense mercy. Multitudes of heavenly hosts and thousands upon thousands of holy angels and a host of spiritual ministers of fire and spirit bow down and adore you, O Most High. And they glorify your name and offer you worship together with the holy cherubim and seraphim. 
praising you with a loud voice and ceasingly we proclaim in jeswar se karte stuti ka ek tu jaise pukar karte pavan 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 ishwar sarva shakti ma prabhu parameshwar tere mahima gari maniranda गुंसित हे प्रभु अमरियंब तेरी हो प्रभु जय जय कार उसाना उसाना धन्य हे जो प्रभु पावन नाम पर आया हो हरदम जय जय का उसारा उसारा हे प्रभु ईश्वर इन सभी स्वर्गवासियों के साथ हम तेरा धन्यवाद करते हैं जो शब्द स्वयं ईश्वर हैं और तेरा आत्मज हैं उसकी हम उपासना करते हैं वह तेरे सादृश्य हैं तेरे दीप्ति हेम और तेरे तत्व का प्रतिरूप हेम तेरे बराबर होते हुए भी दास का रूप धारण कर उसने अपने को दीनहीन बना लिया वह विवेक बुद्धि और अमरता से संबंध आत्मा के साथ न शरीर को अपनाकर पूर्ण मानव बना स्त्री से जन्म और नियम के अधीन रहने वालों को मुक्त करने के लिए नियम के अधीन रह उसने हमारी मुक्ति के स्मारक के रूप में एक रहस्य में प्रदान किया जो हम तुझे चढ़ा रहे हैं लॉर्ड आवर गॉड वी कोमेमरेट द पैशन ऑफ यूर बिलवर्ड सन एस ही टोटस on the night he was handed over jesus took bread in his pure and holy hands lifted up his eyes to heaven to you the adorable father blessed it broke it and gave it to the disciples saying this is my body which is broken for you for the forgiveness of sins take this all of you and eat it Amen. Likewise, taking the cup, he gave thanks, blessed it, and gave it to them, saying, "This is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for many for the forgiveness of sins. Take this, all of you, and drink from it." Amen. Whenever you gather together in my name do this in memory of me He Prabhu tere aadesh anusar hum bhi tere durbal din hi sever tere sanidh mein ekatr hue hain tune hum par itna upakar kiya hai jisko dhanyawad dena hamare liye asambhav hai tere ishwar ke jeevan mein hame sabhagi banane ke liye tune hamara manav swabhav अपनाया तूने हम पतों को उद्धार किया हम मृतकों को जीवित किया हम पापियों को पवित्र किया हम अपराधियों को मोचित किया तूने हमारी बुद्धि को आलोकित किया शत्रुओं को पराजित किया और हमारे दुर्बल स्वभाव को अपनी प्रजुर कृपा से अलंकृत किया है वे गिव यू ग्लोरी एंड ऑनर थैंक्स गिविंग एंड एडोरेशन for all your favors and graces you have granted us now always and forever amen pray in your hearts peace be with us he prabhu sarva shakti man ishwar hamare jagat guru samasta ke lesia ke paramadhyaksh rom ke sambodhya mar francis ke liye hamare ke lesia ke pita aur mukya major archbishop mar george ke liye हमारे धर्मांतिष मार गुरिया कोष के लिए और मार जोश के लिए 
पवित्र और सार्वत्रिक लेसिया के लिए या जगह समर्पित एवं लोग धर्मी प्रेरितों के लिए शासकों और अधिकारियों के लिए एक बलिदान स्वीकार कर हे प्रभु हे बलिदान स्वीकार कर for the honor and glory of all prophets disciples martyrs confessors and all the just and holy fathers who have found favor in your presence lord receive this kurbana lord graciously receive this kurbana dukhi aur vyakul daridra aur dalit dogi aur pidit in sabam ke liye tere naam par hum se vida lekar sitare samrat ko ke liye तेरी कृपा की प्रतीक्षा करने वाले इन भक्तों के लिए विशेषकर नया संस्थापित मेरी क्यून ऑफ द मिशंस रीजन के लिए और हमारे लिए भी जो दुर्बल और अयोग्य हैं ये बलिदान स्वीकार कर हे प्रभु ये बलिदान स्वीकार कर हे प्रभु तेरे शिष्यानुसार हम शुद्ध और पवित्र वेदी पर तेरे मसीह के शरीर रक्त को चढ़ा रहे हैं इस पुण्य मनोत्सव में तेरी असीम एवं अवनी कृपा से इस मादा कुमारी मरियम का और तेरे कृपा पात्र सभी धार्मिक एवं पवित्र पिताओं का भी पावन स्मरण है हमें जीवन भर अपनी सुख शांति प्रदान कर सभी भुआ सी जानी और माने कि केवल तू ही सच्चा पिता ईश्वर है और तूने अपने प्रिय पुत्र प्रभु ईसा मसीह को इस प्रति भर भेजा है और हम और हमारे ईश्वर ने अपने जीवन दाय सुसमाचार द्वारा नभियों प्रेरदोम सगिदोम संदोम धर्माचार्य धर्मातिशोम याचकों और उभ याचकों की तथा पावन स्नान संस्कार के जीवन दो जीवन दाचन से अंकित हुई पवित्र एवं सार्वतकली सिया के संसंधानों की शुद्धता और पवित्रता का मार्ग हमें सिखलाया हे प्रभु हम भी तेरे दुर्बल और विनम्र सेवक अब तेरे पवित्र नाम पर एकत्र होकर तेरे सानिध्य में उपस्थित हैं परंपरा से प्राप्त उसके उदाहरण के अनुसार हम उसके दुख फोग मृत्यु दफन और पुनरुत्थान के महान गंभीर पवित्र जीवन दाय और दिव्य रहस्यों का स्मरणोत्सव आनंद पूर्वक मनाते हैं Lord our God may your holy spirit descend on this kurbana let us pray pray in silence and reverence peace be with us may he dwell on this kurbana of your servants and bless and sanctify it may this kurbana great grandest remission of our debts forgiveness of our sins great hope in the resurrection of the dead and new life in your heavenly kingdom with all those who have found favor in your presence lord our god we offer you unending praise for your glorious and ineffable plan for our salvation we offer you thanksgiving with joy and hope in your church redeemed by the precious blood of your anointed one we offer you glory and honor thanksgiving and worship to you to your living holy and life giving name now always and forever amen have mercy on me o god in your loving kindness in your great compassion wipe away my sins bless us o lord may your mercy draw us near to these glorious sacred life giving and divine mysteries though truly we are unworthy o lord jesus christ may there be glory to your name and worship to your majesty forever for this living and life giving bread has come down from heaven and gives life to the whole world whoever eats this bread will not die but will receive remission of sins 
attain salvation and live forever. सर्ग से उतरी जीवन रोटी मैं हूँ जीवन दायक रोटी प्रेम से मेरे पास जो आते और मुझको ग्रहण भी करते सब मुझ में सर्वदा रहते अनश्वर जीवन में ही पाते अपने मुक्ति दादा शिष्य गणों से ऐसा ही कहा the grace of our lord jesus christ the love of god the father and the fellowship of the holy spirit be with us all now always and forever amen, amen. let us approach the mysteries of the precious body and blood of our savior with a reverence and respect with a hope arising from repentance let us turn away from wrong doing repent of our sins and forgive the trespasses of our brothers and sisters Let us pray to God the Lord of all for mercy and forgiveness. Prabhu ji kar de paap kshama daan aparado ko bhul daya va कल लढ़ाई से हट जाए मन के सारे मेल मिठाए प्रभु जी कर दे अब राजों को भूल दिया परम प्रसाद तो पावन होवे दिव्यात्मा से प्रभु जी कर दे पाप क्षमा अब राजों को भूल दिया वतन के पुनरुत्थान आत्मा मुक्ति बनिए साधन आनंद जीवन के हित हो वे आनंद जीवन के हित हो वे Lord our God make us worthy to be in your presence with the confidence you have besto- mercifully bestowed on us enable us to stand in your presence with cheerful face and pure hearts calling upon you together we pray our father in heaven hallowed be your name your kingdom come your will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day the bread we need and forgive us our debts and sins as we have forgiven those who offended us do not let us fall into temptation but deliver us from the evil one for yours is the kingdom the power and the glory forever and ever amen lord god almighty fullness of all goodness our merciful father we entreat you for your mercy do not lead us to temptation deliver us from the evil one and his host for yours is the kingdom the might the power and the dominion in heaven and on earth 
now, always, and forever. Amen. Amen. Peace be with you. With you and with your spirit. The holy Kurbana is for the holy people. God the Father alone is holy. God the Son alone is holy. God the Spirit alone is holy. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit forever. Amen. Let us praise the living God. Let, Let there be eternal praise to him in the church. church. Let, Let his blessings, blessings and mercy be on us at all times. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, who gives us life, be made perfect in us through his mercy. Always and forever. Amen. Brothers and sisters, the Holy Church invites you to receive the body and blood of the Son of God with faith in the heavenly kingdom.
ਇੱਕ ਦੂਜੇ ਕੋ ਪਰਮੇਸ਼ਵਰ ਨੇ ਪ੍ਰਭੂ ਯੀਸ਼ 
of my debts and the remission of my sins, I know not that I shall come again to offer another sacrifice. Tuma Sri Hadan Makkal Naa 
ശ്രീര ശിഷ്യന്തേ വീരമക്കൾ തോമാ ശ്രീനാഥൻ മക്കൾ നാര ശിഷ്യന്തേ വീരമക്കൾ വിശ്വാസദീപം പകരാനാ ക്രിസ്തുവിൻ സാക്ഷികളാകുവ വിശ്വാസദീപം പകരാനാ ക്രിസ്തുവിൻ സാക്ഷികളാകുവ തോമാ ശ്രീഹാരൻ മക്കൾ നാ ധീരശിഷ്യന്തേ ധീരമക്കൾ പോകുവിൻ ഘോഷിക്കുവിൻ യേശുവിൻ സന്ദേശം പോകുവിൻ ഘോഷിക്കുവിൻ സ്നേഹത്തിൻ സന്ദേശം പോകുവിൻ ഘോഷിക്കുവിൻ യേശുവിൻ സന്ദേശം പോകുവിൻ ഘോഷിക്കുവിൻ സ്നേഹത്തിൻ സന്ദേശം ശ്വാസദീപത്തിൻ പ്രേഷിത ജ്വാല ജ്വലിക്കട്ടെ സ്നേഹമായി കരുണയായി വിശ്വാസദീപത്തിൻ പ്രേഷിത ജ്വാല ജ്വലിക്കട്ടെ സ്നേഹമായി കരുണയായി അയക്കുക നിൻ പാവനാത്മാവിനെ ഘോഷിക്കുവാൻ നിൻ തിരുനാമം അയക്കുക നിൻ പാവനാത്മാവിനെ ഘോഷിക്കുവാൻ നിൻ തിരുനാമം തോമാ ശ്രീഹാദൻ മക്കൾ നാ ധീരശിഷ്യന്റെ ധീരമക്കൾ പോകുവിൻ ഘോഷിക്കുവിൻ യേശുവിൻ സന്ദേശം പോകുവിൻ ഘോഷിക്കുവിൻ സ്നേഹത്തിൻ സന്ദേശം പോകുവിൻ ഘോഷിക്കുവിൻ യേശുവിൻ സന്ദേശം പോകുവിൻ ഘോഷിക്കുവിൻ സ്നേഹത്തിൻ സന്ദേശം
had in the past many moments of struggle and stress we could find missionary satisfaction and providence of god in the growth of this mission so it becomes important for us to look back and thank god for what we have today our joy is doubled and we are blessed with your presence and with your prayers as our delegation is being elevated into the status of a mission region let us begin this missionary gathering with invoking the grace of god i welcome the students of dipti ashram for a prayer dance
ಸರ್ವಶಕ್ತಾದೇವೇ ವಿಶ್ವಸಿಪ್ಪು ಮರ್ತ್ಯರ ಞಳಂಗೈ welcome is an essential aspect of expressing our honor towards the people who joined us and became part of this ceremony we have for santosh olapurekel the regional director elected with us i cordially invite for the santosh for the welcome address your grace archbishop anil joseph thomas kutto archbishop of the archdiocese of delhi your grace archbishop mar kuriyakos bhernikulangara archbishop of the diocese of faridabad your excellency mar jos putanvitil the auxiliary bishop of faridabad very reverend father antony perumanur the director general of missionary society of saint thomas apostle reverend sister grace pungudi provincial superior of sacred heart congregation delhi province regional directors and coordinators of the msc missions all provincial superiors reverend fathers reverend sisters collaborators well wishes and my dear friends good morning to all of you The Missionary Society of St. Thomas Apostle is a missionary venture of the Siro Malabar Church. The main thrust of the MST is to foster and promote missionary activities of the church. 44 years down the road, 54 years down the road, the society has come a long way in the missionary activities in India and abroad. Today, MST has 387 priest members witnessing the gospel in 17 different countries on five continents the society has over 210 candidates under five stages of formation in its own formation houses staffed by qualified and experienced teams of formators for the effectiveness of apostolate and for administrative efficiency the mst established regions and delegations in view of extending its missionary work in the extreme northern states of india the mst established a delegation called saint mary cumna the mission delegation in delhi in 2014 in fact the mst presence in delhi started in 1986 fathers sebastian kadakel and james mandaban were the pioneers in organizing the migrants of the siro malabar community in delhi which later resulted in the formation of the diocese of faridabad then father md thomas also worked in delhi as the cbci cbci secretary to the commission of for ecumenism and interfaith dialogue still he continues his work of interfaith dialogue to the institute of harmony and peace studies from the year 2004 onwards under the guidance of his grace archbishop vincent concesavo the mst priest started working for the empowerment of people living with hiv aids fathers thomas karamel and sabu mabakavil started the ministry for the people living with hiv aids from then number of priests from mst worked in delhi in different capacities I gratefully acknowledge all the pioneer missionaries in Delhi especially Raven Fathers Thomas Karamel Sabu Mapar Kavil Sibi Vadakamputar Vadake Putamburil Joseph Koren Sajan Chikalekal Jose Kartugudil Tommy 
റവൻഡ് ഫാദേഴ്സ് തോമസ് കാറാമേൽ സാബുമ പ്രകാവിൽ സിബി വടക്കംപുത്തർ വടക്കേ പുത്തംപുരയിൽ ജോസഫ് കോരൻ സാജൻ ചിക്കാലക്കൽ ജോസ് കാട്ടുകുടിയിൽ ടോമി മാധവ് പള്ളിയിൽ മാത്യു മുത്താശ്ശേരിയിൽ ബിനോയ് കൂട്ടുങ്കൽ ലിജോ കൗന്നുകാട്ടിൽ ജോൺസൺ കുപ്പയിൽ ആൻഡ് സിജു കൊൽത്താമ്പ്രയിൽ ഓൾ ഓഫ് ദം വർക്ക് വെരി ഹാർഡ് ഫോർ ദ ഗ്രോത്ത് ആൻഡ് ഡെവലപ്മെൻ്റ് ഓഫ് അവർ മിഷൻ അണ്ടർ ദ ബാനർ ഓഫ് ദീപ്തി ഫൗണ്ടേഷൻ ഐ ഡിക് ഐ ടേക്ക് ദിസ് ഓപ്പർച്യൂണിറ്റി ടു താങ്ക്ഫുള്ളി റിമെമ്പർ ഹിസ് ഗ്രേസ് ആച്ച് ബിഷപ്പ് എമൃത്തൂസ് വിൻസെൻറ്റ് കൊൻസാവു ആൻഡ് ഹിസ് ഗ്രേസ് ആച്ച് ബിഷപ്പ് അനിൽ ജോസഫ് തോമസ് കൂട്ടോ for their timely guidance and support throughout these years in establishing the foundation for the Mary Queen of the Missions Delegation Delhi. May I place on record that it is with the permission and guidance of His Grace Archbishop Emeritus Vincent Kunsasavo that we were able to start the work among the people living with HIV AIDS and to construct this Deepthi Ashram here. Though His Grace is not present with us today, once again I thankfully remember Him for His encouragement and guidance. When the Diocese of Faridabas was established in 2012, being a society of apostolic life in the Syro Malabar Church, the MST priest working in Delhi came under the Syro Malabar Diocese of Faridabad. from then we are under the able leadership of his grace archbishop mark kuriakos bharnikulangara though my duty is to welcome him now i make use of this opportunity to thank his grace mark kuriakos bharnikulangara for his support at the time of the establishment of mst delegation in 2014 and the elevation of this delegation into a region today till 2014 the mst priest was working only in the geographical area of delhi from 2014 as a delegation we developed beyond delhi to west punjab and himachal pradesh ran father joseph alligard was appointed as the first delegate along with father joseph kulathangal as the first counselor and father kurian kochetonil as the second counselor and procurator Then in 2016, Father Joseph Mudupalakil succeeded Father Vallikat as a delegate together with Father Abraham Chambotigal, the first council, and Father Sandosh Olaparikil as the second councillor and procreator. Then in 2018, I was appointed as the third delegate together with Father Joseph Karodan as the first councillor and Father Shijo Titalikil as the second councillor and procreator. I sincerely thank my predecessors. father is only god father mudplakal and former councillors for their leadership and incessant effort in developing the delegation into a mission region on this fine occasion i also thankfully remember all the former director generales and council members of the society especially the three former central administration teams under which the mst apostolate in this area achieved former assistance and development i gratefully recall reverend father kurian apanathunel and bishop mar james james adigalam and the councillors of those period for their vision and support for the msc mission in delhi area in the past four years under the leadership of the present director general reverend father antony perimonur and the general councillors supported the mission for the fast development of different sundays and thus materializing the resolution of the last general assembly of the mst by elevating this delegation into a mission region i also remember all msts who have worked in this delegation different capacities especially father father george utpalanil father joseph kannandadam father mons kiravagunel and father manu maprail and remember their contribution in shaping the delegation into a region i also thankfully acknowledge the great contributions given by our loving late reverend father sibi nellur his vision and love for the mission is reflected in the growing faith communities of rodu and chidugavin himachal pradesh 
I also take this opportunity to thank all our well-wishers, benefactors, friends and sister collaborators for their association and key role in elevating this delegation into a region. St. Mary Queen of the Missions delegation geographically covers five North Indian states, namely Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Punjab, Haryana, Delhi and some regions of Uttar Pradesh, namely Gautam Buddha Nagar and Ghaziabad which is co-extensive with the area of the Diocese of Faridabad. As of now, we have 14 centers of apostolates in different places of this vast territory. Among them, eight are in Punjab, four in Delhi, and two in Himachal Pradesh. There are 34 MST priests assigned to this mission region. And 16 of them are already part of the missionary team of this new region. We have designed an integral model of missionary work, offering opportunities for all strata of people to meaningfully encounter Christ's love and mercy as well as to make church more relevant and appreciable to the people. The three main thrust areas of the delegation are mission among people, second one, works of mercy, interfaith activities and human promotions, and third one is pastoral care of the immigrants of Syro Malabar Church. As per the above mentioned three thrust areas, the following missionary activities are taking place in Mary Queen of the Missions region, Delhi. Mission among peoples. Right now, there are five Christian communities under the formation in the villages near Batinda, Bedaud, Delon in Punjab, and Rudu and Chidugav in Himachal Pradesh. Works of mercy, interfaith activities, and human promotion. Works of mercy and empowering activities are carried out under the Deepthi Foundation Trust. Projects are mainly implemented under this one is first first one is empowering the children and families involved in rag picking. Second one is child resource center for the children involved in rag picking. Third one is empowering people living with HIV AIDS. Fourth one is empowering women and children from the urban clusters of East Delhi. Fifth one is care home for the HIV infected boys. Sixth one is Hostel for the children from the families involved in rag picking. Seventh one is interfaith activities are carried out by the Institute of Harmony and Peace Studies by Reverend Father M.D. Thomas at Dwaraga. Then there are three schools of formal education that is in Batinda, Delon, and Bedaud in Punjab. Parcel care of the Siromalar migrants. In the Diocese of Faridabad, four parishas, parishas are managed by MSC priests. In all the mission centers, especially in Batinda, Bikki, Duri, and Delon, pastoral care of the migrants are taking place. This is all about the new region named after Mary, Queen of the Missions, which is going to be elevated as a mission region right now. Now let me come to my duty of welcoming our chief guest on the dais, His Grace Archbishop Mark Kuriyakus Barnikulangara. The Archbishop Faridabad is present in this gathering. He is our guardian and leader. Archbishop always supports us for anything and everything. His grace never says no. His grace is a zealous missionary and always encourages all the missionary and the ways of the MST priest and is very friendly with our priest working in the diocese. On behalf of our Director General, Reverend Father Anthony Pirimanur and all gathered here, I cordially welcome Archbishop Mark Kuriyas, Kuriyakos Bhannikulangara to this program. His Grace Archbishop Anil Joseph Thomas Kudoy, the Archbishop of Delhi is here with us today. He is ever ready to give us any support and help. Twice I approached His Grace for some recommendation letters and without any delay, he did the needful at the earliest. We thank you for your love and encouragement to waste the MST mission. In the name of our Director General and Father Anjani Pirimanur and everyone gathered here, I cordially welcome Archbishop Anil Joseph Thomas Kuto to this program. His Excellency Bishop Mark Joseph Joseph Putanvitil, the Auxiliary Bishop of the Diocese of Faridabad is with us. 
His Excellency is very much interested in the missionary and the ways of the MST and appreciates and encourages the new missionary activities of the MST place in both in Punjab and Himachal Pradesh. To His Excellency visited mission Sundays in Himachal Pradesh and spent time with the faithful, living with minimum facilities. His Excellency is a very simple and humble missionary. On behalf of our Director General, Reverend Father Anjani Perimanur, and all who are gathered here, I cordially welcome His Excellency Ma Joseph Putanvitil to this gathering. Very Reverend Father Anjani Perimanur, the Director General of MST, is present here. And he deserves the full credit for elevating this delegation into a mission region. He has got special love for the mission and always encourages and extends support for all the new missionary and the ways of Mary Kuna, the mission's delegation. On behalf of all the fathers assigned to this new region and all those, all those who are gathered here, I welcome the Reverend Father Antony Pirimanur to this function. There are a number of religious congregations in Delhi, especially Najafkat, and we all maintain a cordial relationship and collaboration irrespective of different rites and dices we, we belong to. Representing all the congregations, Reverend Sister Grace Pungudi, the Provincial Superior of the Sacred Heart Congregation, is present here. So on behalf of all, I cordially welcome Reverend Sister Grace Esach to this function. May I recognize the presence of all the regional directors and coordinators of different MST missions. Rector of Ruhalia Seminary, very lovingly, I welcome all of them to this function. Dear provincial superiors of different congregations, Fathers and sisters who are our neighbors and collaborators, a very hearty welcome to all of you to this meeting. With love, I welcome all our friends, well wishes, benefactors, neighbors, members of Sandom Fellowship of the Misty in Delhi, our staff and collaborators. A very warm welcome to all of you. Dear friends, Mary Kuno, the missions region, is in its infancy. What we need are your prayers and support. So please do remember Mary Queen of the Missions region in your prayers. Along with Fathers Joseph Karodan and Nebin Kuchipurekil, I am taking up the humble ministry of giving leadership service for this new region today. I beseech your prayerful support for the, support for the three of us and for all 34 members assigned to this region invoking God's blessing and looking forward to your future collaboration and support. I remain. Thank you very much. We thankfully remember you, Father Sandos, for your words of welcome and honor. We also acknowledge it is our duty to welcome you to this gathering. So we extend a hearty welcome to you, dear Father Santosh. Finally, it is time for the inauguration. Every act of inauguration is celebrated with a lighting, the lighting of the lamp because light symbolizes Christ himself who is the center of our life and mission. Now I request all the dignitaries to kindly join us in the lamp lighting ceremony.
now it is my pleasure to invite very reverend father anthony perimano the director general of mst to make the announcement of new region and then to give and bless us with his words marwala my lord and my god mere prabhu mere ishwar ende kartave ende devame gospel of st john chapter 20 verse 28 your grace archbishop anil joseph thomas kutu archbishop of the archdiocese of delhi Your Grace Archbishop Mark Kuriakos Bharani Kulangara Archbishop Bishop of the Eparchy Archbishop of the Eparchy of Faridabad Your Excellency Mark Joseph Potan Beetle the Auxiliary Bishop of the Eparchy of Faridabad Reverend Sister Grace Pumkudi Provincial Superior of Sacred Heart Congregation Delhi Province Reverend Father Thomas Santosh Alapurekil new regional director of st mary queen of the missions delhi region and all respected general councillors of the mst reverend regional directors and the coordinator of the missions and all the major superiors present here my dear reverend fathers reverend sisters all collaborators well wishes and my dear friends with gratitude to god and with your permission i would like to read the decree of the constitution of saint mary queen of the missions region delhi of the missionary society of saint thomas the apostle The Missionary Society of St Thomas the Apostle MST founded on 22nd February 1968 by Bishop Mar Sebastian Weil of happy memory is a common venture of the Sierra Malabar Church for the purpose of mission advances in India and outside Constitutions number 2 As a missionary society of apostolic life of major archiepiscopal right in the Sierra Malabar church the mst shares the missionary responsibilities of this church constitution number 3 for the sake of effective missionary apostolate and administration the mst functions through administrative units called mission region and delegations constitution number 55 in addition to three mission regions of st paul region centered at ujjain in madhya pradesh st thomas region centered at mantia in karnataka and st alphonse region centered at kolhapur sangli in maharashtra from the year 2014 the mst has been formally engaging mission advances initiatives of the parkey of faridabad through its mary queen of the missions delegation centered in delhi with the intention of collectively participating in the mission of the sierra malabar church in the parkey of faridabad on a long term basis in, in accordance with resolution number 2 of the 10th ordinary general assembly of the mst held in may 2018 and with the consent of the general council i do hereby constitute saint mary queen of the missions delegation delhi as the fourth mission region of the mst following the constitutions and directives of the society numbers 56 to 58 summoning the same heavenly patrons of the delegation this new mission region of the mst shall be known as saint mary queen of the missions region delhi and it comes into effect today on 22nd february 2022 the 55th foundation day of the mst The MST presence in Delhi started informally in 1986 for the pastoral care of the Sierra Malabar immigrants in the Faridabad area. 
From 2004, it formally started missionary apostolates in the Archdiocese of Delhi. The erection of the Sira Malabar Eparchy of Faridabad in 2012 triggered the missionary enthusiasm of the MST and with the consent of His Grace Mark Kuriakos Bharani Gulangara, the MST organized and intensified its missionary efforts by erecting a delegation on 3rd July 2014. The range and nature of the missionary involvement of the delegation were articulated through a formal agreement between the Parque of Faridabad and the MST on 3rd December 2014. The territory of the delegation was coextensive with the territory of the Parque of Faridabad, five states of Delhi, Haryana, Punjab, Himachal Pradesh, and Jammu and Kashmir, and two civil districts of Gautam Budhnagar and Ghaziabad in Uttar Pradesh. As envisaged in the decree of erection of the delegation, and stated in the agreement with the Eparchy of Adidabad, the delegation was being established in view of developing into a mission region. Within a short span of seven years, the delegation made many missionary breakthroughs and advanced into 14 mission centers in different parts of the area. In accordance with the existing agreement between the MST and the Eparchy of Adidabad, the territory of this new mission region is also coextensive with the territory of the Parque of Adidabad, and it enjoys the privilege of exploring the possibilities of mission agendas in concurrence with the nature and purpose of the MST as enshrined in its constitutions and directives under the jurisdiction of the Parque of Adidabad in accordance with the common law, CCEO, and the particular laws of the Sierra Malabar Church. As a mission region of the MST, St. Mary Kivin of the Missions region has its nature and scope envisaged in the constitutions and directives of the MST, CND numbers 56 to 58, and it is a juridical person in the church. There are 34 purposely incorporated members assigned to this new mission region, and among them, 16 are doing apostolates within the region. The regional director, Reverend Father Thomas Olapurikil, and the regional councillors, Reverend Fathers Joseph Kadodin and Skaria Ebin Kuchuparikil, have been appointed as per constitutions and directives of the MST numbers 116 and 117 for the ensuing period of the current central administration of the MST. Acting in unison with the regional council, the regional director guides and supports the members in their missionary endeavors and administers the region in accordance with the constitutions and directives of the MST. Invoking the heavenly protection of Blessed Virgin Mary, Queen of the Missions, the patroness of the region, and St. Thomas the Apostle, the heavenly patron of the society, I do hereby constitute St. Mary, Queen of the Missions, Region Delhi, and all contrary dispositions notwithstanding, given on the 22nd day of the month of February of the year 2022, the 55th Foundation Day of the Missionary Society of St. Thomas the Apostle. Thank you. Thank you very much for patiently listening to this decree. Gaudate Mater Ecclesia. Mother Church rejoices. It is said by Pope John 23rd of Happy Memory in his opening speech of the Second Vatican Council on October 11, 1962. We know that many changes took place after the Second Vatican Council. Today I would like to borrow this phrase and say that the Syro Malabar Church rejoices. The Parque of Faridabad rejoices. Above all, the Missionary Society of St. Thomas rejoices. Because today on 22nd February 2022, 22 to 2022, a unique day. The, 50th, the 55th Foundation Day of the MST, a new mission region is constituted for effective missionary involvements and administration. 
the fourth mission region of the MST is in addition to St. Paul Mission Region Ujjain in Madhya Pradesh, St. Thomas Mission Region Mandia in Karnataka, and St. Alphonse Mission Region Sangli in Maharashtra. There is also St. Joseph Mission Coordination in Odisha in the eparchy of Shamshabad. I said that Sira Malabar Church rejoices today. There is a reason. Because MST is a missionary venture of the Sierra Malabar Church and it is canonically classified according to the societies of apostolic life of major archiepiscopal status. On 25th February 1975, Cardinal Philip, former prefect of the Oriental Congregation, while writing a letter to late Reverend Father Joseph Mali Parambil, of happy memory. It is said that MST is blossomed in the heart of the Sierra Malabar Church, and which inherits a large portion of the apostolic heritage of St. Thomas the Apostle. And that is the reason that I said the Sierra Malabar Church to rejoices when MST constitutes the fourth mission region in Delhi. Recently, in one of the messages of our father and head of the church, Madhra Archbishop, Cardinal George Allen Cherry, it is said that there is a new missionary culture in the church by the Argentus initiatives of the MSTs. I can say that MST is a missionary hand of the Sierra Malabar Church, and through this fourth mission region of the MST, we will be able to fulfill the mission adjunct responsibilities of the Sierra Malabar Church, always remaining faithful to the Sierra Malabar traditions. At the Park of Faridabad to rejoice, because no, we know that every missionary activity is done under the direction and guidance of the local hierarch. And the Mary Queen of the Missions region has got His Grace Marcuriakos Barani Golangara as the local hierarch. And I am very sure that this new region in the park of Haridabad will locally involves in various activities among the people. As Father Santos told, with acts of mercy and pastoral care, under the pastoral guidance of His Grace, Archbishop. And we know that His Grace, during the homily, reminded us of our responsibility to be the missionary and pastoral collaborators of the Eparchy of Faridabad. And I am very sure that by the constitution of this mission region, we will be able to do effective missionary work in the Eparchy of Faridabad. And above all, the MST rejoices today. The Lord has worked wonders through the members of the MST in various parts of the globe, especially in our motherland. Going to the places and peripheries not reached by anyone and giving the message of Jesus Christ, God's love and mercy, by extending the caring hands of the members is a unique attitude of the missionary activities of the members of the MST. The initiative of the Mary Queen Missions region in bringing out to the mainstream hundreds of children, the landfills of Balaswa is a concrete example for the works of Acts of Mercy. Today, on 22nd, 2nd, 2022, the MST has a full-fledged 
administrative unit for the effective missionary activities. We know that we have got a new regional director, Reverend Father Sandosh Alapurikil. Under his able guidance and leadership, and with the collaboration and cooperation of his counselors, Reverend Father Joseph Karodan and Reverend Father Ebin Kochubarekil, they will do wonders in this new mission region. On behalf of the general counselors and members of the MST, and all those who have gathered here, I have the joy to extend you, Reverend Father Sandosh Alaparikil, and your team, my prayers, best wishes, God's blessings, and congratulations. We are very confident that under your guidance and leadership, Mary Queen of the Missions will be involving in the missionary activities, always being faithful to the MST vision and mission. I also extend all my best wishes to all those 34 members who are assigned to this mission region. And in a special way, 16 members who are actively working in this part of the mission region. I remember with gratitude former delegates, Reverend Father Joseph Balligat and his team, Reverend Father Joseph Muthuplakil and his team for their tireless efforts to bring Christ to the world. May St. Thomas, the heavenly patron of the MST, intercede for us missionaries to be able to share the Christ experience to the peoples in India and outside. May the patroness of the new mission region, Mary, Queen of the Missions, may always intercede for the new mission region. I remain, thank you very much for your patient listening. Jai MST, Jai Mary, Queen of the Missions. Thank you very much. Thank you very Reverend Father Anthony Perumanur for the words of appreciation and felicitation. We extend our gratitude for announcing the new region. Mary Queen of the Missions region sincerely thanks you. Every organization will have its own logo and motto. Mary Queen of the Mission region has also prepared a beautiful logo. I take this opportunity to ask His Grace Archbishop Anil Joseph Thomas Kuto to release the logo and then to encourage us with his words. Archbishop Mar Kuriakos Barney Kulangara, Your Excellency Auxiliary Bishop Mar Joseph Jos Putinwitil, our Director General of MST's uh, Father uh, Anthony Pirumanur, our new regional superior of the newly erected region, Father Santosh Ola Purakal, dear sister Grace the Provincial of the Sacred Heart Sisters, all the Reverend Fathers, especially of the MSTs, Reverend Sisters, and all people of God present here. It is indeed a very joyful occasion when we are present here to witness the erection of this new region, and a memorable occasion too 
it is not only a day of rejoicing for the Siro Malabar Church, but it is a day of rejoicing for the entire Indian Church and the Universal Church, I would say. And that shows that the uh, mission work of the Church has grown. The seed that was sown long ago uh, has grown from a sapling to a young tree now, bearing fruits, and there is uh, a whole future ahead. The sky is the limit. We thank God for this. And if you go back to the entire history of the church, this is the way we have grown from a small little uh, uh, gathering of people in a, in a small place where there is sometimes not even a place to worship. It gradually becomes a uh, mass center, then a quasi-parish, then a parish, and then a diocese, and so on and so forth. So, it's God's blessings on the journey. So thank you very much for inviting me to be present here for this uh, occasion uh, because also the Archdiocese of Delhi, as you have already heard, uh, has been very much part of the MST presence in this area. When you all came to Delhi, there was no the eparchy of Faridabad. It was the Archdiocese of Delhi and the mission work of the church was carried on through the Archdiocese of Delhi till the establishment of the Diocese of Faridabad in 2012. And so soon, a decade has passed. I can't believe it myself. Our, uh, our dear Archbishop Bani Kulangara is 10 years of bishop. Eh? Uh, and by May, he will be 10 years. He looks very young. Just, yes, just yesterday, he was consecrated bishop. We also are, uh, pray for the eternal repose of his dear mother, beloved mom, who passed away not too long ago, that God may grant her eternal rest in his kingdom and that we may have an intercessor in heaven for us. I pray that the uh, region may be definitely a step ahead to carry on the work that the MST fathers are committed to. And that is, as we have heard, the work of evangelization. Just yesterday, we had an a, a inter-religious uh, gathering. I, too, could, I could not be present there, but uh, we had uh, leaders from Delhi. Some of us know who they are, representing various uh, religions. And uh, one of them uh, remarked about, uh, and this was a gathering for synodality. Pope has asked us to have a dialogue with uh, other people and Father M.D. Thomas is there. He knows it. I'm sure he was there yesterday. Were you there? No. Uh, the, uh, uh, the, the, the wish of the Holy Father that we should talk with uh, not only with other Christians but also with people of other faiths. And somebody I heard remarked about the use of our term evangelization uh, which means that we are only maybe as being brand banded about today that we are out only to convert, convert, but it is not so. And if you read the entire theology of evangelization, which we, are, which we use in the Catholic Church, very specially, is, is precisely this, to uplift people, to stand for justice, to stand for human rights, to stand for uh, the dignity of the human person, to stand for the oppressed, to stand for all that our Lord Jesus Christ anointed in the Holy Spirit stood for and manifested to the whole of humanity. That is evangelization, which Pope Paul VI has clearly explained to us in Evangelii Nunciandi. So this is what we stand for. I'm so glad that our MST fathers are committed primarily to evangelization in all its dimensions, in all its aspects. And that is the joy of the church always and which includes the pastoral work, which includes, uh, uh, of course, proclamation of the gospel, direct proclamation of the gospel, which includes, uh, uh, and very especially, all, that, all the activities that we have been witnessing through what is happening here for the interventions in the humanitarian field to give a hope and a future to our children. We saw them dancing here, so nice, and uh, in so many other parts of our country. So I bring the congratulations and the assurance of prayers of the Archdiocese of Delhi on this very joyful occasion and pray that this work may carry on uh, with 
full zest, enthusiasm as the years go by. There may be, it may grow. There may be many more uh, people, many more priests uh, to uh, uh, help in this work. The region may grow and through the intercession of Mary, Queen of the Missions, and also of a blessed spouse, St. Joseph, and especially the Apostle St. Thomas, and all the saints. Thank you. God bless you all. Thank you, Your Grace, for your kind words and action. May I also take this moment to explain the meaning of the logo. You may see it on the screen there. The crown in the middle symbolizes the crown of Mother Mary in reference to Revelation 12.1. There are four green dots on the, on the crown that means four evangelists. St. Thomas Cross is there in the middle of the cross which shows the resurrected Christ. On the bottom of the crown, we see five brown dots, which reflects five continents where MST priests are working. Beneath the crown, we see the alphabet M with a mountain structure, which reflects Mother Mary again, and mountain states of uh, northern part, which parts that come under this region, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, and Jammu Kashmir. The book is the Bible, and the motto word, Marg Satya Jeevan, words of Jesus to St. Thomas, which is more relevant to St. Thomas Christians and to MST. The wheat coming out of the Bible gives us the meaning of Eucharist as well as 100% yield in, the, in this field. It is also related with the cultivation of Punjab, Haryana and Delhi. There is a reverse love shape which shows God's love from heaven to earth. Outer side we see 12 stars again, refers to Revelation 12.1, Mother Mary, and again 12 apostles. Three lines we can see straight connecting the 12 stars, which has the meaning of Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, and a sign of unity. Thank you. And I also make this opportunity to thank sincerely Father Bibin Vernakunel MST for designing this logo. We sincerely thank Father Bibin. Finally, the time has come to hear from our shepherd. Let us heed and listen to his words. I welcome His Grace Archbishop Kuryakos Mar Bharani Kulangara for the presidential address. Dear Archbishop Anil and other dignitaries on the dais, my dear fathers, sisters, and friends, As we have a new region, I would like to pose a question to all the MSTs. It was mentioned the society is now 54 years old. My question is why this society was uh, started, constituted 54 years back. Seniors may know but I, I don't think the youngsters who were ordained recently may not have that clear picture about the, we used to say the razon that the logic behind starting such a missionary initiative, 54 years back. I see this in another perspective. Still four years ago, in 1964, Pope Paul VI visited India, Bombay, for the Eucharistic Congress. There, Pope insisted, India, your salvation is in your own hands. Bharadame ninde raksha ninde kaigalil ninde makkalil. Ida arvati anbati ettu varshamunbe annatte siromalabar sabayile alingil Indian churchilun daayirna oru new awarenessan. And naturally, Sira Malabar Church, especially the Diocese of Pala, blessed with so many vocations to priesthood and religious life, took up the initiative. Some of the senior priests there thought about this new call and started this society for the missionary outreach. And somehow, because of many reasons, 
it was not expanded it was not uh, uh, fully functional in the north especially since the diocese of faridabad is erected for the greater north i would say with six states not one small states with their territory six times bigger than kerala you should know the area where you are uh, uh, functioning six times greater than kerala now this has assumed a new form to the of a region and this is the uh, new challenge we face to bring salvation to india especially to the greater north with a population of you know how many how much is the population of our diocese 200 million not the zero malabar or the latin or christian 200 million people live here and we are sent to that area and we have to do something and that's why that is the importance of a society like mst during the mass in the homily i told what you are doing in uh, india in the north i would like to highlight the international trait of the msts you are doing a lot of things outside india you will be surprised to hear 30% of the msts are out of india 30% for a congregation this is a really uh, di- uh, very <laughs> very different you know 30% of the msts are outside india but we need not see it in a negative sense it has got its own positive aspects bishop john perumattam used to talk about evangelization by presence we have evangelization ad jantas direct evangelization and there is another form of evangelization is merely by your presence you may not be doing to preach and do village visits like in punjab or in somewhere we are doing here but your own presence in a non christian milieu will give a message of jesus christ that is indirect evangelization i have met with um, uh, msts in africa tansani our sakarias adiganikel when i was in then later went to new york i we had together pr- prepared a presentation at the united nations about the social and charitable activities msts are doing in africa and in, in germany in the us everywhere there are so many uh, missionaries i would say so the fact that you are outside is not negative it is positive you are uh, engaging in evangelization by presence in all these areas in the vision concept of msts which i quoted during the mass it is ke- clearly mentioned all over the world inside and outside india and i am sure some of you listening to this from outside india i invite you cordially to india and to the north for at least for a sabbatical year or to make a break for 3 years and you have a wonderful example before you father cb nellur he is a starting first missionary in a, a successful missionary i would say in himachal pradesh i should think he was not uh, running go, going around in italy he was having a wonderful life like any of you in europe in the us and then he came back to india and chose the hardest uh, uh, hardship post in india a new pioneer area of himachal pradesh and within a short time he formed communities there he has to take them to kerala and show the uh, christian centers in kerala and like that also we have here people like chembotti who was in canada babu was in us you can make a difference by serving 2 3 years in the mission adijendas area primitive pure mission areas in north india and our sisters are doing that our fathers are doing that and this To, uh, uh, land is very fertile i would say we don't have a lot of conflict here normally we are branded as a, a land of problems but you see 10 years i am here spending 25 years out of india and i am positively surprised we have a wonderful atmosphere for missionaries in these six states in the greater north that's why i invite all of you 39 people now members and many others are in the north to come and have a mission experience in this missionary diocese and we see our um, father uh, tungudi he
He spent his whole life outside and he chose Faridabad to work. Like that, those who are outside can also come and do some kind of missionary work here. Once again, Father Sandosh and Father Karodan, his assistant, wish you all the best and blessings of the day. God bless you. I will request the new regional director, our Father Sandosh Alaparikil, and his counselors, Reverend Father Joseph Karodan and Reverend Father Ebin Kuchiparikil, to come and receive the episcopal blessings from His Grace, Mark Kudiakos, Marinagulamera. Thank you, Your Grace, for your words and prayers. I request the dignitaries to take your seat among the audience. Once again, our little ones from Dipti Ashram are ready with a beautiful dance. Let us enjoy their performance.
I feel extremely proud to welcome His Excellency Mar Jos Putanvetil for a felicitation speech and I request His Excellency to release the geographical map of the Mary Queen of the Missions region Delhi. Your Grace, Archbishop Anil Kuto, our Archbishop Kuriakos, MST Director General, Seminary Mate, Reverend Father Anthony Permanur, the Provincial of SH Congregation, Mother and Sister Grace, Reverend Father Sandosh Olapurikal, the newly appointed Region Director, Reverend Fathers, Sisters, Brothers, and my dear friends in Jesus Christ, Sariyanu Jayeshudi. This is a Punjabi, a special greeting from Punjabi missionaries. Jesus said, You are the light of the world, 
and let your light shine upon the whole world. In 1968, a light was lit in Deepthi, and then after 54 years, the light shines brightly. Let us thank the Lord for all the blessings showered upon MST society. As the new region is uh, declared, I am extremely happy because of the name St. Mary Queen of Missions, well chosen uh, name. And on this special day, as uh, Father Anthony Pirimayan said, comes only once in 100 years to 22 to 22. It's a unique day on the 55th anniversary of the foundation of MST. I congratulate the Director General, my seminary mate, Reverend Father Anthony Pirmanur, General Counselors, and uh, in a special way, the new region director, my friend, Dost, uh, Father Sandosh, Father Joseph Karodan, and Father Skaria. Wish you all the best so that by your uh, passionate mission, let the North India shine brightly. As the Archbishop Anil Kuto said, elevation of a new region, the fourth region in MST, is a blessing for the Universal Church, for the Indian Church, and for Syro Malabar Church, and in a special way for Faridabad Diocese. Because Faridabad Diocese this year completes 10th year. And uh, this declaration is a gift to Faridabad Diocese. And uh, thank uh, MST Fathers for choosing this year to declare this region as a new region, St. Mary Queen region of uh, missions. After coming to North, especially as I am in Luthiana, in Punjab, I encounter MST fathers. And I am really inspired by the missionary work of MST fathers. As you know, to elevate a delegation to a region, you need only 12 priests. But it is amazing that uh, 34 has opted for this uh, region. That shows the passion the MST young blood has now. And most of them are young blood and it is amazing. So uh, I am hopeful that uh, in few years this region will shine very well in MST family. I also like the methodology, the mission methodology uh, taken by MST fathers. After visiting Himachal Pradesh, where Father Sibi worked very well, he studied, uh, I think uh, he took a doctorate in missiology. And after coming to uh, Himachal Pradesh, he developed a wonderful methodology. Not uh, baptizing everyone uh, uh, with the initial formation, but step by step. And one step is that he takes uh, a few people every year to Kerala to see and to experience the Catholic faith in Kerala. And when they come back, they introduce their share with other friends also. When I went to Rodu, Himachal Pradesh, Father Sanoj and Sibi said that uh, in Rodu they have started family prayer because when they went to Kerala, they stayed in families, and which is unique for Kerala church, everywhere rosary reciting family prayer. And when they came back without telling by anyone, they started family prayer. So 
there are a lot of uh, new uh, developments uh, uh, introduced by Father Sibi and that new methodology is wonderful which can be adopted by other missionaries also. Then uh, uh, the MST Koinonia, because uh, they have a communion among themselves, they have every month, they have monthly regression, coming together, evaluation of the ministry and so on. So that the Koinonia is very strong. That is also needed in mission. We have to support each other. So that is also very well appreciated uh, what uh, MST fathers do in the mission, especially in this region. Uh, once uh, a press reporter asked uh, Saint uh, Mother Teresa, uh, Mother, as uh, she was alive, uh, he asked, uh, Mother, how many convents you have in the world? So Mother said, uh, we don't have convents. We have 584 tabernacles. Because uh, her mission was uh, centered on Eucharist. So if uh, somebody asks how many mission stations uh, you have, how many institutions you have, dear MST fathers, we don't have to say we have mission stations, we have uh, institution, but we have to always say that we have uh, this number of faith communities where new people experience Jesus. So that would be the replay we should give, I think, especially the motto of MST is uh, to foster and promote mission. So that should be given priority. And now Siro Malabar has taken special uh, interest to develop a mission and uh, uh, inspiring many young people to go for missions. As we uh, uh, joyfully celebrate this day, I once again congratulate the Director General and the whole team, MST Fathers. And also, I extend my prayerful greetings to Father Santosh and team, so that uh, the team, MST team in uh, St. Mary Kuhn region may work well, passionately for the Kingdom of God. Thank you. God bless you.